Hi guys! Welcome back sa YouTube channel ko. So for today, meron na naman tayong random math problem. This time, galing from basic geometry. So this is just a review of the basic concepts regarding similar triangles, etc. So napakadali lang itong problem na to for as long na alam yung basic concept ng similarities. So ito yung problem natin. So at least recap lang tayo mga Lodi ah. 5 lines parallel to the base of a triangle divide each of the other sides into 6 distinct parts. If the area... If the area of the largest of these parts uh, is 33, then what is the area of the original triangle? So, I think para may kulang yata dito sa ano natin. Ah, okay. So, yung kulang pala dito mga Lodi is yung dapat congruent yung ano niya, yung division niya. So, magkakaiba lang sila ng areas. Okay? So, lalagay ko na lang dun sa mismong thumbnail natin yung pinaka actual question niya. Pero, ganun po yung tanong. So, meron daw tayong triangle. Okay? So, let's say meron tayong uh, triangle here. Tapos, meron daw tayong limang parallel lines dun sa base. So, let's say this is the first one. Okay, we have the second, the third, the fourth, and the fifth. So, as you can see, the, the triangle will be divided into six distinct regions. We have region 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. Right? Sinabi na if the area of the largest of these parts is 33, so this is 33, right? Then what is the area of the original triangle? Okay, listen carefully. Remember the concept of similarity. If two triangles are similar, so it follows that. Naalala pa ba yung similarity? So they are similar if, if the angles are congruent, right? If the angles of the triangle are congruent, and the same time, angles are congruent. At the same time, the sides are in proportional, or they, are, uh, they form a proportion. Diba? Ganun po siya. Kasi ang pinagkaiba ng similar at ng congruent triangles, congruent at least, I mean, lahat talaga congruent. Lahat ng angles, pati yung sides. Pero dito naman, kapag similar, lahat ng angles equal pa rin. Kung bagay yung isang triangle, lahat ng corresponding angles nun equal dun sa, paneba, sa isang triangle. Pero, yung sides lang hindi equal, they are just in proportional. Okay, mga Lodi? Okay. So, ang sinasabi dyan na kulang kasi, ito equal to mga Lodi. Kung baga ito, pare-parehas po yan ng value 1. Parang ganyan yan, mga Lodi. Equal sila. Let's say, parang uh, 1 na lang. Parang, parang 1 is to 1. Is to 1 is to 1 is to 1 is to 1. Okay. Tapos, kung mapapansin yung mga Lodi, ano daw yung area nito? 33. Consider natin tong triangle na to. Ito, mga Lodi. Okay. So, ano yung pinaka side nito? Kunyari, 1 limang 1 yan. Di ba pag ito kinumbay natin mga Lodi, this is 5. So, considering the this region excluding the bottom one. So, we have a triangle in which itong side natin is 5. Tapos, yung buong triangle naman natin is 6. Naalala pa po ba yung uh, yung atawag dito, yung concept ng similar areas, mga Lodi? Kunyari, if two triangles are similar, so let's say meron tayong triangle 1 uh, that is similar to triangle 2 which is which has side B. So these are similar triangles. So this is the symbol of similarity, right? If these two triangles are similar, then the ratio of their areas is just the square of the corresponding sides. For example, the side here is A and the corresponding to that is side B. Therefore, the ratio of the first triangle over the ratio of the over the area of the second triangle is equal to the square of the cor ratio of the corresponding sides. Okay? So, ganun po siya mga Lodi. Kasi kapag volume naman, kapag nag 3 na tayo, cube naman yon Pero kapag area, you just square either the heights or the corresponding sides. Ganun po siya. So, paano pong gagawin natin yung Sir IJ? So, di ba ito 5? Tapos yung buo natin 6. Therefore, kung baga meron tayong isang triangle na kung saan dito is 5, tapos yung isa naman, this is 6, these are similar triangles. So, ano yung magiging ratio ng area nila? So, ang area natin, area A1 over A2, that is 5 over 6 squared. Kasi nga, applying the concept of similar uh, areas, mga Lodi, area of similar triangles, right? Actually, this is also applicable to the area of similar polygons, mga Lodi. Pare-parehas lang po yan. So, triangles kasi yung pinaka-basic triangle kasi yung pinaka -basic nating polygon. So, 5 to, eto 6, square lang po natin yan para malaman natin yung ratio ng area nitong triangle na to over dun sa buo. So, ilan to mga idol? Okay, tama ka dyan. 25 over 36. So, ito, ibig sabihin ng 25 over 36, 25 over 36, ito nang buo. Therefore, ilan na lang yung natitira sa ilalim? E di minus mo to sa 1. So, 1 minus 25 over 36, 
that is 11 over 36. So this is 11 of 33 is 11 over 36 of the whole area. Let's say AO is the area of the original triangle. So we have 33 divided 11, that's 3 times 36. Therefore, the area of the original triangle is equal to 108 uh, square units, mga lodi. Okay, ganun lang po yung pagkuha niyan. If ever na ito yung itanong, ganun lang din po yung concept, basta ibibigay yung mga area dito sa ilalim. So, yun mga lodi, sana na-recap kayo ng mga concept ng similar triangles. And if ever you have questions or clarifications, so okay, mahiya mag-comment sa comment section. Thank you so much mga lodi sa mga patuloy na sumusupport sa channel natin. And I hope you all the best. Pagpalain kayo, Lord, keep safe na lang. And focus na lang kayo mga lodi sa mga goals nyo sa buhay nyo. And, and mga idol, subscribe din po pala kayo sa mother ko, Mary and Maling. Kulay orange po yung profile ni Mami. And yun, support po natin yung vlog niya about cooking. And yun mga Lodi, kita-kits na lang sa mga susunod na match tutorial ni Sir IJ. And God bless mga idol. And bye-bye!